guys we are going to now talk about yule as you guys know yule is um it is christmas and obviously with the southern hemisphere being the way it is and celebrating with the seasons it is christmas only once a year so i do celebrate yule at christmas time um i don't celebrate uh, Yule in July like normal in the Sabbaths so I'm going to go through um, some of the little witchy things that you can do to celebrate Yule and to just basically celebrate Christmas and bring it in like we do every year first of all we're going to talk about some spell work that is really good at Yule time that would be love uh, prosperity is a really good one new beginnings fresh starts new opportunities ridding yourself of those obstacles to start fresh for the new year really good cleansings doing things with the family and doing spells to help the family careers anything to better yourself or improve or to um start fresh for the new year really good sense for you would be frankincense cedar pine um, we also have clove being a really good one, oranges, um, cranberries is a really good one, uh, juniper berry is another really good scent for the Christmas season. Some really good herbs for Yule is holly, mistletoe, bless thistle, other things is rosemary is really good for this time of year and also frankincense is another really good one to associate with christmas symbols of hot of yule basically would be um greenery and having that greenery around christmas trees um it's also reefs we have the holly the mistletoe uh timber timber is a really good one that i associate with yule another thing to associate with yule would be um some things to do for Yule would be um, Yule logs. You can also do baking. Baking is a really big thing um, at Yule. Um, another thing would be decorating Christmas trees, um, DIYing reefs and also making reefs. Other things you can do is forage from outside and bring it inside, meaning the leaves like pine, cedar, uh, juniper, any of those kinds of plants you can bring inside, holly, mistletoe, decorate with it. Um, other things that you can do is bake um, and dry out some orange slices. You can use them in your decorating. You can put them on banners. You can make decorations out of them. Even making crafts. Crafts is a big thing at Christmas. You can uh, make your own ornaments. You can make your own banners. You can bake with the kids. Um, other things you can do is um, a you can bake a yule log so instead of making an actual yule log you can bake one and make it out of a cake um other things is being grateful and just spending time with your family and basically talking about memories of past loved ones and bringing them back into the spotlight and basically talking about the people that are no longer with us but the memories that we shared with them here are some ideas that you could do for Yule. This is just a Yule log that you could do. You could do pomegranates. You could also do a Yule log that you interchange every so that you change out the actual herbs and do it with the correspondences. This is just easier way than burning it or then having to do one every single year. As you can see, I've used things from my garden. Doing a simmer pot, doing a bath mix even that is Yule inspired. I did do a hand cream. It has been used, but basically you can use any hand cream in your stash and just use Christmas scents and incorporate it and it can just put you in that mood. Other things you could do is make your own decorations. As you guys know, this is a witch's ball, but you could make an association sort of very similar, but put wishes for the new year or uh, things you want to manifest. Or things that you want to fix um, for the new year um, you could do a number of different things you could do one for each family member or associate it with the person that you're making it for like things that they like the crystal they like the flower they like 
things like that um, and it's handmade you could also put names on it you could put words on it you could put sigils on it um, and just associate it with that person and make it more custom to them um, but these are just some ideas for your hope for you Scott these are just some different things you can do for you I just wanted to wish you all a Merry Christmas thank you so much for supporting me the past year and kicking my YouTube TikTok Instagram, Facebook, and also for my students who have joined me this year to start my own classes. It has been an absolutely wonderful year and I can't wait for the new year to come and for some wonderful things to start. So um, if you just want to join the magical family on here, be sure to like and subscribe, leave a comment down below. And I just want to say Merry Christmas to everyone and I hope you have a great Christmas with your family. We have COVID in this house at the moment, so as you can hear, sneezing in the background, so fun. But hopefully it's gone by Christmas. So I will talk to you all later. Keep witching. Stay blessed.